Life is good all this month at Appalachian Wireless. Get the LG G5 for just one penny with sign-up or renewal of a two-year service agreement. That's almost $100 off the regular price. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. A national campaign for tobacco-free kids known as Kick Butts Day was recognized today in a collaborative effort between the Floyd County Health Department and schools in the Floyd County school system, including Adams Middle School. We've done several different things. We have a display set up for the kids in the hallway to show them some of the different um, uh, effects of smoking. Uh, my Unite Club kids are out here doing uh, Don't Smoke in the, in the fence so that people that drive by can uh, get that message also. We're also going to be writing some statistics down on the sidewalk here in a few minutes in the sidewalk chalk so that way when the kids come out uh, for bus duty this evening they'll see those messages also. So it's kind of an all day effort just trying to get as much information into the, you know, for them as possible. Although Kick Butts Day is designed to help carry the message of the dangers of tobacco use to students, the students themselves can carry a message as well. A lot of peer pressure is here and most people don't realize how dangerous it is to smoke and especially tobacco products. So it's just really important that they know how like, you know, dangerous tobacco is. Well, my parents smoke, but they're quitting right now, so I have noticed that. But I also have seen that it can cause lung cancer, but also it can cause like dangers in your neck. I have learned that smoking causes like lung cancer and a lot of health problems. When you use tobacco products, it always leads to like cancer, and it's not good for your body. And we're trying to spread the word to not smoke to the young kids of uh, Adams Middle School and the people that drive by. For more information on Kick Butts Day, simply visit the web address listed on your screen. Reporting from Prestonsburg for EKB News, I'm Sean Allen.